Hi friends, I'm glad you're here. Today we're making a sausage and bean soup in the Instant Pot. The first thing I'm gonna do is brown a pound of pork sausage. And you can use, if you like the spicy, use that. If you like it, you know, just mild, that's fine too. It's just basically up to you guys. If your sausage needs drained, you can do that. Um, and then add and one onion chopped up. I've got, I'm using a small onion. Add a couple of tablespoons of garlic minced up. Saute those a little bit. Now I'm gonna pour in my chicken broth to deglaze that a little bit. I'm gonna add some more chicken broth here in a minute, but I'll let you know let you guys have the, the amounts down below in case I missed something. Alright, so I'm using great northern beans. I cooked a pound ahead of time and drained those because I I think they're more easily digestible when I do that. So if you guys want to do that, that's up to you. Um, if you if you don't want to use the, the dried beans and, and have them pre-cooked, you can use about, I would suggest at least three to four cans of um, beans. I have six cups here. I'm using a jar of tomatoes and I would suggest you guys use about a 15 ounce can. This is about the same, uh, pretty close to that. Here I have basil, salt, pepper, and a little bit of thyme. About an eighth of a teaspoon of thyme. I'm adding a teaspoon of ground sage. And I'm adding a couple of cups of water and a teaspoon of rosemary. And then I'm gonna give it a stir. Okay, make sure that your lid is sealed. The ceiling. It's at that timer for 10 minutes. So I've let this natural release for 10 minutes and now I'm gonna finish releasing the pressure. Now, if you guys want to thicken that, you can turn on the saute button and cook it down a little bit more. Or you can use a, a cornstarch slurry to, to thicken it a little bit. Okay, so I'm gonna give this a taste for you guys. This is my favorite part. I thought a batch of flatjacks would go really well with this, so that's what I'm having with it. You guys. If you guys watch my channel, you'll know that that recipe is on there for you guys. Mm, it smells so good, it's so good. It's been driving my little pup crazy. He's been wanting his sample. He don't miss out on very many samples. Be kind to one another. Thanks for watching.